Hi, I will be demonstrating the usage of the Yola tablet with Sailfish 2.0. You can double tap to wake up the tablet like you uh, can do on the Yola phone as well. And with a single swipe from the edge, you come to the home screen. The home screen will show you the currently running applications. We have a bit of changes from the first version of Sailfish with the Yola phone. And uh, one of the main thing is that we'll have this um, different uh, views from the left and the right from the home screen in, in the carousel fashion. For example, when you do um, from the left, you get, get, get the events view. In the events view, we have added some functionalities and features. For example, uh, you don't just see how many messages you missed, but you actually see who they are from and a sn snippet of the message. Uh, you can tap either messages to go to the messaging app or you can tap on the actual message itself to go directly to the message. And if you notice, we also have this uh, split keyboard, especially for on the, with when you are typing in the landscape mode, because um, it's easier to reach. You don't have to stretch your uh, thumbs too far to type. However, in the uh, portrait mode, it goes back to the uh, uh, normal kind of uh, keyboard layout. And one of the f another feature I would like to demonstrate is that because sometimes when you rotate, you might not remember where the volume keys are. You can use the three finger sliding action to adjust the volume up and down. So that's one of the new features that even I just discovered. And then with another gesture, swipe gesture, you come to this, uh, this new concept called the partner space. With partner space, we offer a premium space for uh, partners to uh, showcase their content. It could be music, videos, uh, catalogs, um, whatever that the partner wants to uh, put on this screen. And uh, with one more swipe, you go back to the home screen. So you have this uh, carousel of three different views. Uh, of course, the partner space is an optional feature. If it does not exist, you have just the events and the home screen, and you can rotate between these two. From any uh, view or, or, or screen, you can do an edge swipe from the bottom up. This will give you the app grid, where it shows you the currently available applications on your tablet, whether it's uh, Sailfish native applications or the Android applications that we support. When you go back to the home, if you notice, um, events view again, same thing. Just swipe up, you can get um, application grid. And this is a little bit different from the previous version, where um, the app grid is continued from the home screen in a vertical manner. Uh, the advantage of this is, if you are in, inside an application, you can also swipe up and get the application grid right there, instead of having to go back to the home screen to open the app. Side swipe to go back to home. Um, another uh, feature we have is if you swipe down from the top, you get the uh, what we call the ambient switcher, where you can select, uh, sorry, a different uh, ambience, so it changes your um, the mood of the tablet with one single gesture.